All nations have geniuses they are proud of. For Ukraine, especially for Poltava, one of them is a prominent theorist of space, a brilliant engineer, inventor, innovator Yuri Kondratyuk. This year, the country celebrates the 120th anniversary of the birth of the science and technology titan. Yuri Kondratyuk went down in history as the author of many original ideas and not just for space. In particular, in his writings, he first substantiated economic physics of the vertical takeoff of rockets. Use of sunlight and gravitation field of celestial bodies for acceleration of rockets. Creating intermediate bases during flights. Energy supply for the Earth and many more. However, his greatest achievement is the project of calculation of manned flight to the moon. It is the calculation used by Americans for their Apollo mission. More than 20 of Kondratyuk's original ideas and developments in space and rocketry were highly praised by the scientific community. Yuri Kondratyuk was inducted to the International Space Hall of Fame in the United States by grateful Earthlings. Also a crater on the far side of the moon and a minor planet of the solar system got his name. And in 1997, to mark the 100th anniversary of his birth, by the decision of the government of Ukraine, Poltava National Technical University was named after here. Poltava National Technical Yuri Kondratyuk University is the leading higher educational establishment of Poltava region. Poltan II is the center of engineering and science education in the region. It enjoys the highest demand among the youths of the city and the region. During the last decade, Poltava National Technical Yuri Kondratyuk University is developing dynamically. Number of specialties of training specialists with higher education has increased by half. Currently, the university has formed more than 40 educational programs for bachelors and masters. The university includes six faculties, one educational institute, 42 departments, 32 of which are graduate chairs. The university students are now being trained at the Faculty of Architecture, Civil Engineering Faculty, Electromechanical Faculty, Faculty of Computer Sciences and Telecommunication Technologies and Systems, Faculty of Oil, Gas and Environmental Sciences, Faculty of Humanities, Educational and Research Institute of Finance, Economies and Management. Two powerful institutions within the university, Poltava Oil and Gas College and Mirhorod Art and Industry Mikola Gog College provide training in 17 specialties in the stepwise levels – junior, specialist, bachelor, and master. The model of cooperation of the college and the university has been successfully operating for five years. During this time, Poltava Oil and Gas College has seamlessly integrated into the structure of the university and has many significant achievements. On the eve of its 50th anniversary, we provide continuous training of highly qualified specialists for the oil and gas industry. Over recent decades, the strategic course of Poltava Technical University development has been to promote international relations with 68 foreign partners from 22 countries, namely Poland, the United Kingdom, Germany, Belgium, Latvia, the United States, and the People's Republic of China. In our university, there are English language master's programs providing Ukrainian and English language learning opportunities. Today, we can say for sure that our university trains high-skilled professionals according to European standards. We participate in the program for the development of education until 2020 that enables our students to undergo training at European universities and take advantage of the double degree program. Together with our British partner University of Greenwich, we also participate in programs of the British Council in Ukraine, such as the English for Universities project and the Ukraine Higher Education Leadership Development Program. Our faculty takes part in Erasmus Plus projects and Horizon 2020. We also participate in the One Belt, One Road initiative together with the government of the People's Republic of China and our partner universities in China. 
In 2015, they published the Bometrics Ranking of World's Universities, an annual web ranking of universities all over the world. There, in country rank, Poltava National Technical University ranked 16th in Ukraine. In 2016, the university ranked 29th in the four international colleges and universities international ranking. In the same year, our university won an honorary title Leader in International Activities. Our university carries out efficient research and innovation activities. That is enabled by the development and powerful research work of 10 scientific schools recognized worldwide. It should be noted that this fact can be confirmed by the number of our faculty's research articles published in journals registered in Scopus database in which our university ranks first in our region among all the institutions of higher education under the Ministry of Education and Science of Ukraine. The University's Council of Young Scientists works most efficiently. Every year, its members receive awards of the President of Ukraine, scholarships of the Cabinet of Ministers of Ukraine, and other annual awards for students and post-credits. Activities of every department are aimed at transferring technologies and scientific research results into practice. The civil engineering faculty, which is the same age as our university, is one of the leading ones in research and innovation activities. In our faculty, there is Ukraine's only scientific school which studies reliability of building structures. Results received by our scientific school have been embedded in design standards. The civil engineering faculty is securely based on the foundation created by our predecessors. Our staff is highly skilled and optimistic about the future. Also, the establishment has significant result in attracting financial investments. Thanks to cooperation between business, government and university, Oil and Gas Modern Laboratory was founded at one of the university faculties. Laboratory was built first of all to provide the educational process in the discipline of drilling there and other specialized disciplines. Furthermore, scientific work is conducted in this laboratory. Postgraduate students and students of master's degree carry out their experiments and work here. And Polton II is known for its scientific and technical developments and improvements. The results of the basic research are unique and go beyond attained world level. Teachers, headed by the rector, continuously conduct extensive work on the renovation and development of training and material facilities. Speaking about current challenges, there are two of them – energy efficiency and environmental safety. At university, we aim not not only to resolve and search for issues to these main challenges, but also participate in tackling such issues and implementation of specific projects. First and foremost, it relates to thermomodernization project. And the result was not slow. We won the competition for funding from the European Investment Bank. Nowadays, the dynamic development of the university can be followed. In its financial activities, it has achieved quite high figures. Salary is paid consistently at the university. Payment for utility services is provided. Events for encouraging university employees and students are regularly held. University also provides all social guarantees which are regulated by the state. One of the significant achievements of the university in recent years is the creation of fundamentally new structural unit, Educational and Research Institute of Finance, Economics and Management. Its research results form the basis of international grant programs. Our rector, Volodymyr Oleksandrovich Onishenko, applied a lot of efforts to create it. This is his idea that is successfully implemented now. We have very good financial position. We have great prospects for development. We found a new lease of life for international and research activities. Our scientific achievements are successfully implemented in development strategy of the region and our town. 
Bolton Tool focuses on the preservation and dissemination of European traditions of humanism. The Faculty of Humanities is the example of it. Its scientific work undermines research of wide range of contemporary issues, philology, literature studies, and methods of translation teaching. The university has a strong humanity air of preserving the important European traditions for its graduates. Among them is deep knowledge of their specialty, ability to take responsibility, ability to keep harmonious balance between inner and outer world. An important feature of a person's refinement is attitude to arts. Bolton to newly opened Contemporary Arts Center facilitates forming of such a feature. It is the place where the teaching staff and students of architectural faculty exhibit their works. Center Contemporary Art Center of Bolton Tool is a professional platform where students of absolutely different specialties, including also not art specialties, can communicate with each other. During two last years, the department is going through its second rebirth and renovation. The department's staff includes two people's artists of Ukraine that provide high-quality art education at the faculty and the university as a whole. There is an internet resource of distance education in the university. It is updated on a regular basis and meets the modern requirements of educational process. Also, there is a free Wi-Fi throughout the university campus. One of the main methods of educational process improvement is the use of modern information and computer technologies. In the university, a great attention is paid to the military patriotic education. Now, the students have a unique opportunity to take a military training within their reserve officer training program and get a military rank together with the main specialty on graduating from the university. По закінченню університету офіцерське звання. Special attention is focused on the students. The institution provides them with all the possibilities to fulfill the potential of their specialty and personality. Various conferences, meetings, master classes, debates, seminars are held regularly along with other events. Due to our rector's support, we established student radio, student television, culture and students art center in the university. Just last year, more than 400 national and patriotic, cultural and artistic volunteering and sporting events were held. Landmark result of the university's administration cooperation with the students has been carrying out students' scientifically practical conference twice already. Young students, the country's driving force, joined by our colleagues from Poland and the USA. In last few years, Poltava National Technical Yuri Kondratuk University became a platform that unites education, science, authority, business and manufacturing in order to train highly qualified specialists. The university pursues higher level of education for its students. Thus, it always seeks new technology, new methods and new educational approaches.